Welcome to Spice Candies. We're making a gummy bear, strawberry gummy bear, and strawberry ice cream all together for my kids. Let's get to it. Let's start with the water. One tablespoon of water. Got one third grams of jam, strawberry jam, of course. There we go. And we're going to just mix it nicely. We've got some strawberries there. There we go. Now we're going to add the gelatin. No sugar added. There's no need in any sugar. Mix in the gelatin. And we'll make sure that it's nicely broken, no clamps of gelatin, nicely and evenly distributed. Now the gelatin will need 10 minutes to soak up the water. Right. And I'll be seeing you guys in 10 minutes. This is ready. And we're going to stick it without the spoon, of course, for 40 seconds in the microwave. Hmm. Well, still a bit not so hot. I'd like to get it to 70 degrees Celsius. We're now at 60. Yeah, spot on. So another 10 seconds should do the trick, so. There we go. And we should be at yeah, 66 and a half, I'd go for that, that's fine. It's very smooth, runny, and it should work. So we have some pieces of fruit here. I'm going to try to incorporate these into the main body here. So let me start pouring, and I'll speed things up by uh, a factor of 11. Tell you what, I'm going to need something a bit bigger for all those um, pieces of uh, strawberries I'm getting from time to time. And these are going to go into the hearts. So let's make some hearts as well. There we go. Gonna give it another 20 seconds. Right. And 14 seconds later, we're a bit too hot. I think we're on the 80. Yes, yeah, 73, that's fine. So it's a cold night. It's getting very sticky. You can always Stick it in the fridge for another, uh, microwave, sorry, for another 10 seconds or so. That should be fine.
Yeah, okay. So we'll have to take these out. And right now they're very, very sticky. So we'll just uh, stick them in the fridge for five minutes. And then we can get these out. And the drips over here, you can see between those, are going to be flushings. They're going to be excess. We can just tear it off. So we can get perfect hearts and perfect teddy bears. Let's get to it. So while our gummy bears are getting hardened in the fridge, got some frozen strawberries from last season and we're going to make our strawberry ice cream. I've got some 200 mils of whipping cream, 32% fat, 3% fat milk, 200 mils again, and a nice bowl of strawberries. Now most people that make any berry or fruit ice cream tend to make too much of it, tend to add too much of the berry or the fruit in it. It's going to have a lot of water in it. It's going to ruin your ice cream. So don't overdo it. So let me pop this in there. First add the berries. There's about a cup of berries here. The milk. There it goes. The milk, the whipping cream. Now if you do the math, we're going to get 16% fat ice cream. Very tasty, but you don't want to overdo it. If you reduce this to about 16% or 15% whipping cream, then you're going to get with something like 9% in the end. So it's going to be a lot more conservative. <laughs> Less fattening. But I don't do ice creams very often. Something like three to four times a year, so I think we've earned it. Right, last but not least, I'm going to add one quarter cups of sugar. As the strawberries are not that sweet, they're sweet, not that sweet. So in order to have our ice cream gently sweet, not really sweet, just a little bit. And let's blend it. Let's sit for a minute. I'm going to poke right through the bottom to see if there is any sugar left, and I think there is. I'm going to... This also helps me make sure there are no strawberries left there. Actually, I think I saw one. Yeah, there's one over there. One strawberry evaded the massacre. Well, I didn't feel any sugar, but I'm going to blend it a little bit more because sugar will make your ice cream very, very powdery because every sugar is going to be a nucleation spot and you're going to have small bubbles or balls, to be more accurate, of ice around every crystal of sugar. So you really want to blend it thoroughly. Put the lid back on, or we'll have a geyser of uh, ice cream. Okay, I think we're done. A total of one minute blending. You don't need much. Let's, uh, let's try some. I'm going to give this a go. Looks really nice and pinkish. Smells like strawberries, of course. That is very good. And I love strawberries. Right, let's turn the ice machine on because if you turn it on after you poured the ice cream butter in, then you're gonna have a slab of ice and not ice cream. So you first turn it on or it freezes and you can't have your ice cream. Let's get going.
Well, this run we're going to release our gummy bears. Okay, we're done. Let's get to it. Well, that's it. Our strawberry gummy bears and strawberry ice cream. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Have a sweet day.